All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, data structures, beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 112. All right. So now we're going to add a new object to the end of the locations array, following the same properties as the rest of the objects. All right. So we're going to set name to fight, button text to an array with attack, dodge, and run in it, button functions with, to an array with attack, dodge, and go town, and text to you are fighting a monster. All right. So for this one, let's just take this uh, last one here. Let's select from 60 all the way up to the end, pardon me, all the way up to the comma on uh, 54. And then let's take that, drop it off like that, comma and all. Let's change this first name to fight, all right? So we'll say fight. And then we're going to change the first thing. We're going to say attack, dodge, and run inside of here. So we'll change this first fight slime to attack, attack, then we'll do dodge in the next one. Dodge. And then we'll do run on go to town square here. All right. So we'll say run. So this one we're going to have uh, attack, dodge, and go town. So we can just leave the go town. We'll say attack and dodge. So attack and then dodge right here. Dodge. And then for this, we're going to say you are fighting a monster, right? So we've got the U. We'll take the E from enter to the E on sum because we also have monsters. All right, let's take out this S in monster and then right in between these, let's say, uh, what are we saying? You are fighting a monster. So are fighting a monster, uh -huh, we already had that. Well, whatever. Anyway, so that should take care of it. Let's uh, check the code, looks good and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 113 and we'll see you next time.